a great topic he talks about in this book is the domestication of humans. Day after day, at home, school, church, on TV, we're told how to live and what kind of behavior is okay or expected. Kids are domesticated the same way that we domesticate dogs and cats, with a system of punishment and reward. You're a good boy if you behave according to what's expected, or a bad boy if you don't. And we're punished many times a day and rewarded many times a day. So eventually we're afraid of getting the punishment, but we're also afraid of not getting the reward. And a great reward is their attention. It feels amazing. So what we do is that we start to pretend to be something we're not, just to meet their expectations. We just want that attention. We just want to be good enough. We feel like we're not good enough. We just want to fit in. So we become a copy of our parents' beliefs and society's beliefs. And what's funny is that eventually we don't even need anyone else to domesticate us. We're so well trained that we become what he calls an auto-domesticated animal. We just do it to ourselves based on the belief systems that we picked up, that we were given. And we judge everything based on these belief systems. The inner judge inside of us will judge everything we say or don't say, do or don't do, think or not think, everything. And the part of you that receives that judgment, that's the part called the victim. That's a part of you that carries the blame, the guilt, the shame. And the part of you that will say things like, I'm not good enough, and the judge will agree. And you get into that crazy cycle, never-ending cycle, which I was stuck in for so freaking long. And everything that challenges, everything that goes against this belief system, tends to cause fear in you. Everything that challenges these belief systems will make you feel unsafe. Because even if the belief systems are not right for you, they still make you feel safe. So it does take a lot of courage to challenge your BS belief systems. It does take a lot of courage. But it truly is a way for you to experience real change in your life. Real change in your life. So challenge your BS. Question your BS. Question everything. Question whether or not you should subscribe to my YouTube channel. Question whether or not you should share this video with someone who might like this message. But I do think you should subscribe to my channel and I do think you should share the video with someone who might like this message. So, I hope that helps. This is Gonzalo Cortes coming to you from the beautiful Sedona, Arizona. More videos coming. Make sure you subscribe and stay tuned so you see where the heck I'll be making these videos from. Alright? Have an amazing day.